Mike Toady2744 here today to show you guys how to tell if your device can be jailbroken at its current firmware state as well as what it can be jailbroken with. Uh, basically, for the last couple of weeks or the last past week, I should say, I haven't made a video because of the fact that I've been working on the website, changing the host and stuff like that, which I'll show you after this. Uh, but basically, all you do on your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad is you go in your uh, browser, such as Google Chrome, it works with that as well, and you go to mofadocs.me slash jbstats, which is available in the description below. Uh, basically all you do is first select your firmware. This is the firmware of your device. You can access this by going into settings, general, about, and then you'll see a firmware, a uh, little tab there, and it'll say your version next to it. In this case, 5.1.1 for me. I'm already jailbroken, by the way. Uh, and then you go ahead and select your device, which you should know what it is, but you can view that in the about menu as well if you don't. Uh, mine is the iPhone 4S. You click check status, and it'll tell you the firmware device, and then it'll say you can jailbreak it with Red Snow or Absinthe 2.0. Um, and basically when they just say Red Snow, that means download the most up-to-date version of Red Snow. Uh, and I'm going to be showing you guys the site here in a bit uh, and tell you guys how you can download these versions and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and do that. Alrighty, so now since you know what firmware your device is and what version of device you have, which is, like I said, I showed you there with mofadocs.me slash jbstats, uh, which, by the way, if you want to know when an iOS 6 jailbreak is coming out, you can check up on the site every now and then. I'll also be posting that article to my blog, iOSnova.com, my website here, uh, which I'm going to be talking about here really quickly. I changed some things up over the past week, uh, which is the reason why I haven't a lot of videos. I actually haven't had any videos for a week now. I'll get back on a regular schedule. I was just changing some stuff stuff up on the website uh, which you guys can see here uh, and I have some downloads so if you want to download a firmware like iOS 1.0 for that device uh, for instance for the original iPhone if you want to download iOS 1.0 you can go ahead and do so uh, and if you want to download the most up-to-date version which would be iOS 6 for the most up-to-date devices you can do so on the firmware tab I have simple iOS versions to download right here off the website. Uh, now for the jailbreak, for instance, now you need to download your jailbreak software. That's the next step after you know what jailbreak software you need. Uh, so as you saw for iOS 5.1.1 iPhone 4S, they said that you could be uh, jailbreaking this using this software, Red Snow. So all you do is find the software, for instance, Red Snow, like I said. Uh, you click on that, it'll take me to iOSnova.com slash jailbreak slash Red Snow, and it'll have a ton of downloads. Which download do you use? The most up-to-date download. If it does not show a specific version, like, uh, for instance, Red Snow 4.0 or something like that, uh, which is not even on 4.0, so I apologize, that was a bad example. But if you use a specific version of of the jailbreak software, you need to be able to use that one. Uh, but if it doesn't say, you just go ahead and download the most up-to-date version. These are one-click downloads, like I said. Uh, so for instance, we're on a Mac, you just click on that and it'll start downloading. I use these downloads myself and they're trusted uh, by me because I obviously use them myself. Uh, so that's where you can download your jailbreak softwares. Now, how do you jailbreak? All I recommend doing is going to Google or whatever uh, search engine you use and simply typing out how to jailbreak iOS 5.1.1 iPhone 4S or whatever device and firmware you have and a tutorial more than likely will show up. If there is a jailbreak out for that device, a tutorial more than likely, like I said, will show up on that search engine because a lot of people make tutorials. I make tutorials every now and then. Whenever I jailbreak, I will make a tutorial and I plan on doing ones uh, or jailbreak tutorials in the near future for more devices and more firmwares and stuff like that. Uh, but that's that. That's basically how you discover if there's a jailbreak available for your device and firmware and where to download the jailbreaking software. Thanks everybody for watching this. I get 2744.